Hey, happy Monday, my lights. Welcome back to Tarot by Cherie. We're going to get started and see what divine messages Spirit has for my loves today. All right, we have the card of deceit that popped out of the deck. Oh, no. Oh, no. All right, let's continue and see what else we have. And guys, as I'm getting started, nice. As we're getting started here, um, I just want to remind some of you, I do have that $15 reading. If you're interested, you can click on the description below the video and email me. Uh, there are other services in there as well. All right. So nice. This is very nice. This six of pentacles is the unexpected windfall. It's a lot of money. It's all about money. The six of pentacles guys. Okay. So usually we start out with, you know, people are feeling down, depressed. They're, they don't have enough money. They're, they're, they're going through it okay so this is a nice start this is the opposite of that this is lots and lots of money um this is about giving money sharing money getting money having money and it is a lot of money it is so much money that you won't mind uh doing humanitarian projects giving your money to others not all of it of course but you're going to have enough that you'll be able to help other people okay and i'm seeing something here about decisions being being made you're going to have a lot of decisions that you can uh, a lot of um, what do I want to say like opportunities you know things that you can do with this uh, this money um, and here is good news regarding the finances okay in the center and I'm seeing that a lot of you are balancing things out now maybe some of you have found a way to balance things out financially I'm seeing a lot of hard work here uh, with my aquas I'm seeing you guys working your asses off okay trying to make ends meet and it looks like a lot of you have figured out uh, creative ways to make a little bit more money um, or to save more money um, guys I always say you know go write a whole list go in your uh, statement and write down all where you where you're spending all your money and see where you can uh, just temporarily you know see what you could do without cutting corners um, get rid of those big uh, two three hundred dollar bundles you have and find a less expensive uh, way to go okay and then some of you who are really having a rough time you can go to the food pantries two or three different ones a week and then that will uh, put more money in your pocket for other things. All right, just an idea there. But here I'm seeing a masculine. Okay, there's something that you're ignoring. There's something toxic going on and you don't want to pay attention to this. Okay, this is something you do not want to face. You do not want to deal with. So you're just kind of, you know, pushing it off. And, um, Spirit is saying it's time to be strong with this. It's time to get, um, you know, because this is bringing in a broken heart. So um, there's you, you have to do something about this and save yourself. Okay, that's basically what I'm getting. All right, let's go further. This is, uh, looks like, well, let me get the cards out. I don't want to jump ahead. Um, all right, this is somebody who is in a commitment that is not happy and you're thinking about what it's going to be like to be single what is my life going to be like not mine yours to be single again okay um, I see that you've actually whether it's you know writing notes on paper or somebody writing notes on paper um, having to do with uh, becoming single or getting divorced or uh, breaking away from a relationship if this is you I need you to comment because um, this is very specific. Yeah, you're feeling stuck about this, but it's really something you want. All right, guys, let me see. Um, okay, this is uh, for my Queen of Cups and my King of Cups. Okay, um, this is not a karmic relationship, even though it looks to be one. Um, there's something going on that's creating a lot of chaos for you. This is not, this is someone else is doing this. Someone else is starting a bunch of shit, uh, trying to come, not trying to come between you, but, but kind of is stirring the pot. 
okay you're gonna have your justice on this okay you two are very strong you're very strong together the queen of cups is an empath she knows exactly what's being done what's up here and i am seeing good news with this justice for the two of you okay so you guys are going to get past this if this is somebody out there please comment i want to know Guys, let me know uh, which scenario is yours as well, if you can, so I know what we're talking about. All right, here I'm seeing something regarding a um all right, so somebody's going through some kind of um emotional state this morning that you're 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 looking for a way out. You desperately want a way out of this situation you're in. And the situation is making you feel ignored, defensive, like you have, like you can't say how you feel. You can't be your authentic self. You're carrying this burden around every single day of your life and you're miserable. You're absolutely miserable. I'm feeling the emotions behind, how, you know, what you go through on the daily and you're not getting anything from this, okay? You're not getting anything. This is a person you're involved with. You're getting nothing from this, okay? So I don't know why you're still there. It might be uh, a financial connection that you can't do without this person because of the finances, okay? Guys, that's why I always tell you, make your security within yourself. Do not look to other people for your security. And if you're going to allow somebody else to, to do that, to cover the bills while you sit back, make sure you have something to fall back on. Always, always make sure that, you know, guys, we know things don't work, right? Marriages fall apart sometimes, relationships. So always have it so that you can fall back on something and know that you can uh, once again take care of yourself if need be. It's a horrible feeling when we get in those situations and we feel like we're stuck there, okay? Don't ever be stuck. Um, make it so that you're not. All right, here I'm seeing this nine of pentacles here next to this ten of cups. This is uh, something somebody, this is about abundance that somebody's been wishing for and hoping for and praying for. Okay, you are going to be making this decision soon. Um, about this partnership. Okay, I'm seeing the stuckness card in between what you want and this partnership. So I, I don't know. There seems to be like something holding you back from taking the next step. This could be a business or something for somebody where they need a partner. They want a partner. They know uh, they'll be able to gain more ground having this um, person in in the partnership helping financially this is going to move the business off the ground get it off the ground and bring in abundance okay and that's what's needed here i'm seeing that um something's getting in the way right now okay and a decision has to be made so maybe the person you have just isn't the right partner and you need to switch switch this person out and find somebody else okay here i'm seeing something regarding a child um, and someone is using their intuition here on, um, this new financial beginning. Okay. So somebody's stressing out about finances, uh, taking care of their child or children, and you are coming up with some brilliant idea that is going to, uh, catapult you. Uh, into this new financial situation that is going to be, I'm seeing success all over this, okay? You're using your intuition and you brought this idea in very quickly and you're putting it to work, all right? Spirit is saying that this is going to be very successful for you. Uh, it's going to flourish. It's going to keep getting better, all right? And you're very persistent and you're very uh, focused on this. And this is awesome, guys. I'm seeing also for somebody who recently feels like they were deceived. And let me tell you something, guys. There is a lot of deceit out there. Okay. Even I was deceived this week by someone. Um, people are desperate right now. We're in desperate times. Okay. So just watch your backs. Watch your backs. Okay. Because people are just about to, to try to do anything 
to uh, up the ante with their finances, okay? But I am seeing deceit next to finances here. And, oh, okay, Spirit is saying this is about to come to an end, all right? We're transitioning and we're moving away from, from the deceit, okay? So something is about to happen. Something big is about to happen, guys, okay, that is going to uh, completely change. Um, I have this, this, I'm having like this vision in my head that the landscape, and I'm hearing the landscape is about to completely change for us, okay? So the world is about to change. We're about to see things in a completely different way. And this is going to be a shock and a surprise to a lot of people. Okay. A lot of people, again, are, are going to have a tough time wrapping their head around this, but this time they're not going to mind. They're not going to mind wrapping their head around it because it's going to be something really good. Okay. So I'll take that. All right. I'm seeing, um, hmm. let's see this for a sec. All right, somebody's uh, going into a second marriage, you have a son, and you're going into your second marriage, okay? And this is going to bring in a lot of happiness and celebration for all of you, all right? And you're, you, you know, you're being looked at, I feel like I'm talking to this masculine, you're being looked at as the star right now. Everybody is so happy about this situation, okay? Everybody loves this Queen of Swords that you're with. And I wish you a lot of happiness. I'm seeing happiness. I'm seeing um, a lot of celebration. And this is a going to be a really strong, good um, connection. Okay. Uh, I have a queen here who is has made a decision to move toward the things you want. All right. You are now in that contemplation mode of trying to... Uh, get rid of all the, the chaos and clear the way, whatever is has been confusing in the past, whatever has been making you feel like this, okay? You are clearing the path now for that. You're getting ready to start making changes in your life. Um, and, you know, this is something that you have been wanting. You're moving toward all of this now. So that's awesome. All right, guys. There, there is the, wow, okay, there is the communication again about this unexpected windfall, so we're going to be hearing something about this. It's going to come in as a victory, guys, for all of us, okay? It's being manifested. So guys, did you all at 8 o'clock the other night, we talked about everybody, you know, um, getting into a meditative state regarding uh, this windfall to come in, trying to meditate it in at the same time. Uh, a lot of us agreed at eight o'clock. Okay. We can do this nightly. If you guys can remember every night at eight o'clock, we'll just simplify it. Okay. Every night at eight o'clock, um, at exactly eight o'clock, we will, uh, start to visualize and pray and manifest in, uh, our finances. Okay. This is ours. It belongs to us. It is not a handout. It is not some dream. This is something, this is law, okay? This is biblical. And it just can't happen until the timing is right. We're in a spiritual war. We are, you know, looking at the old being uh, um, torn apart right now, uh, broken up and disintegrating, all right? Thus, our emotions are all over the place, okay? Um, I, I can't even, you know, I don't know. I'm not feeling great today, guys. I wasn't even going to do the reading. I just, I just don't like to let you guys down. I feel like I'm letting you guys down if I don't come on and do the reading. All right. So please, uh, subscribe for me, like, and hit the bell. It, it, you know, it's a way to give back. It only takes a second. I really appreciate and love you all, each and every one of you. Okay. Um, but this helps me and I, you know, I do need your help from time to time. So, um, Please do that. And I'm going to end the reading on this note, guys. I, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. And you guys take care.